Good morning. Police in Boston are continuing to search for a man accused of Monday's marathon bombing. Let's speak to our correspondent in Watertown, Dominic Waghorn. Hello to you, Dominic. This is the story of Fergie's young players who lived the dream. It's just like it was back in 92. These players have played in more than 3,250 games so far because, of course, one of them... Ryan Giggs is still playing at the age of 40. Just want to ask you a very um, quick question. Before this debate... Sorry if I'm debate, going on, Philip. No, it's, it's absolutely fine. Exciting. It's fascinating. <laughs> we're just running out of time. Yeah. Um, yeah, before sure. this third debate, they were running neck and neck. So do you think this, this debate was pivotal in what the polls are going to say? This is Thrill Seeker Heaven. You know when well, these things seem like a really, magic. really good idea at the time? The when you're up close and personal... Here slightly different story. Over 400 feet up, we're about to drop. Some breaking news for you. It is full time in the Super Bowl 47 and Baltimore Ravens have beaten the San Francisco 49ers. Correspondent in the USA, Philippa Thompson. Uh, what else have the uh, intelligence officials been saying, uh, Philippa? What they're saying, John, is quite frankly, they really don't know at this point in time whose finger was on the trigger. And that's quite interesting because it was only a few days ago that the US Secretary of State, John Kerry, was saying there was overwhelming evidence that Russia was complicit in the attack. Where was it? In the bottom of a chest of drawers. Should have checked, should always be... Oh, but he must man. also make sure he actually replaces the smoke alarm because what he did in frustration was smash the smoke alarm up. You yeah. need smoke alarms in your home. Always Inter remember that. Well, it's interesting, he's called Paul Henry. Wasn't that the name of the actor who played Benny in um, Crossroads? You'd remember that, Steve. I wouldn't. Yeah. I'm far too young. Both men are helping celebrate today's Guinness World Records Day and plan to stay in touch. I hope from now on that we become really good friends and do more things together. I'm inviting him to Turkey. Hopefully, he'll come. And finally, the Sunday Express. Uh, I find this difficult to believe personally. Don't know what you think. But uh, health warnings on alcohol are being demanded after scientists said drinking more than two pints of beer a year, not a month, a year, raises the risk of cancer. What do you reckon? Headlines next here on Sky News.